going to talk about the 20 inch drill press and some of the mods that I've done to it so far. Um, this is a Chinese made machine. Um, there's a couple other importers that I know of that sell this machine. I'm pretty sure that Grizzly has a version of this and I know that Harbor Freight has a version of it. This is the Jet version and this is the one I preferred so I went with this one. First thing I did was uh, change out the handles. Um, I use a little bit bigger um, round steel than, than than the originals, and I replaced the uh, the plastic handles with the with these steel balls. Um, I had the same setup on a uh, on a little jet mill drill I used to have, and I liked it so much on that that was a that was the first thing I did on this one. The main feature that I like about this machine is that it has a tilting table. Um, uh, it'll tilt all the way up 90 degrees and, into the vertical position. And that allows me to drill and tap into a long part, like a shaft, that, that wouldn't fit into the lathe. So having that feature expands uh, the capacity of, of what I can work on in here. So having a uh, XY movement, whether it's a whether it's a table like this or an XY vise, I think makes it a lot easier to um, locate punch marks and 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 put them in direct line with your with your spindle. Um, it, I think it just makes it easier to do accurate drilling jobs, and that's why I had this. And I just made a uh, I just made a plate with some spacers uh, that allow me to. Uh, attach it to the T-nuts in the table. The most valuable modification that I've done to this drill is this uh, spindle lock and DRO assembly. Um, this is what was on there before. And it went like that. And you could lock the uh, you could lock the spindle with this but it was a lot of trouble. So you can see how it's constructed. Um, it bolts onto the existing holes. Uh, everything's attached to this part right here. I had to uh, cut radiuses in the top corners to get it to fit in there. And it has this rod here that's connected to the to the column. Uh, has adjustable stop here, and the DRO is just connected to this piece of uh, angle iron. Here and is connected here with uh, double sided tape. So the lock works really well, uh, locks easily in place, you don't have to put any pressure on it. And I uh, have a, a, a flat milled on this, on this part right here and gives it a, gives it a place to contact. So that's it. Um, next mod is to wire the motor so it will reverse. Uh, that will allow me to uh, power tap into a part and then reverse the motor and back the tap back out. Um, that's going to be pretty much just a, a wiring job. going to have to uh, replace this switch and probably make a, have to make a new switch plate for it. So that's it. The Jet 20 inch drill press. Mods and overview. So till next time. Thanks for watching.